Today I want to share Janelle's fibromyalgia story. I want to share a story of bravery, a story of triumph, and really a story of great victory. Remember that great victories often happen when you overcome overwhelming obstacles. This was certainly the case with Janelle's story. She suffered from all the symptoms of fibromyalgia for close to 10 years. She had been to multiple doctors. She was treated like three different people with three different problems. Medicating each problem separately, she wondered why they didn't treat her like a whole person. She was unhappy with the results of modern medicine. They could only cover the symptoms with medications, never really addressing the underlying cause. She spent hours on hours doing online research, attending health-related webinars, reading books, and attempting to educate herself to break free from the symptoms that had plagued her for so very long. She struggled with fatigue, low energy, brain fog, gastrointestinal pain and dysfunction. Through the frustration, fear, anger, embarrassment, and pain, she was determined to regain her health. Do you know what she did next? She prayed. You may not hear that much these days, but prayer actually works, and it sure did in her case. After weeks of prayer, she continued her online search, and she bumped into a functional medicine practitioner who was an unashamed Christian. That's right, a Christ follower. After examining his work and his reputation and his results, she met with him. He did an in-depth health history, reviewed her past medical records, reviewed some metabolic assessment forms to identify underlying health issues and then devised a treatment plan not based on symptoms but on the underlying health conditions that cause the symptoms. There was a clear and easy to see success path along with action steps and milestones to show progress and measure improvement. It wasn't necessarily easy to comply with the dietary and lifestyle changes that were necessary. But remember, she was brave and she wanted her life back. She was determined not to become an invalid, unable to take care of herself or her family, unable to enjoy her children or grandchildren. She would stop at nothing until she regained her health. I'd like for you to hear her share a small piece of her story directly. Well, wh why did you seek me out anyway? How did that happen? Um, I had come to the end of the road with the previous doctor. There was, there was no progress in, in over a year. And um, I got the, well, if there's anything else speech, um, you know, and so I was very frustrated, very dissatisfied. Um, I, had, I had seen some improvement because my health was in a poor state and so some of the supplements he'd given um did help but at a, at a point um he started focusing on cholesterol and that was it there was there was no more talk of my digestive system my energy my sleep and uh, i knew through researching on the internet um watching being a part of health seminars and webinars and different things i, I knew there was more so um Yes, I prayed. <laughs> I did, and um, found found your information. Okay. And and then what? Like, what did we do that was different from the previous physician? Um, number one, the the different testing. You know, not relying on traditional uh, blood testing to you know just taking the answers from that, but the the intensive questions for the um, like the metabolic assessment and um, getting a deeper understanding of, of me, of my symptoms, of what was wrong. And um, for several years been felt like I had been treated like I was three different people for the 
three different sim uh, systems that I was having issues with and I'm one whole person and, and so to be um, treated as such uh, makes a difference. Okay, very good. And then, so we're, we're, I guess we're probably four months or thereabouts right. uh, into the, the, the program. And so from, from the way you felt from our start, and I know you had some improvement up to that point, and the way you feel now, percentage-wise, um, if you're doing everything properly, how much mm -hmm. better do you feel? Um. I feel a hundred percent better. That's pretty awesome. That yeah. is pretty awesome. It's, it's, it's dramatic life change. Yes. Okay. Now, now what, you know, what's equally as important is how confident are you at this point that you can stay better? You are comfortable with your ability and your knowledge to maintain the benefits that you've gotten. Yes. Yes. Okay. That's that's important. Even though you're going to have challenges, obstacles, yeah, obstacles. obstacles and challenges, but you're you're capable of overcoming that. Now, um, for someone who may be struggling from a condition like fibromyalgia or chronic fatigue syndrome or things along those lines. Would you suggest that they pursue like a functional medicine type of pathway? Yes, absolutely. That's the only answer. I would like for you to celebrate Janelle's victory over the symptoms of fibromyalgia. In my book, she is a hero. She chose to walk away from the modern medical norms of symptom treatment to dig into the causes of her condition to make real and lasting change. Janelle, we salute you and we thank you for your bravery, your persistence, your willingness to do something different.